Let me tell you about one of the weirdest and coolest vintage watch collaborations that a lot of people don't even know happened. It all starts with Andrew Greenlee, a legendary jeweler from the mid-century. He was really well known for his ornate and organic designs. The client list even included the Queen of England. In 1969, Swiss watchmaker Omega, while still dealing with the moon launch, approached Grima to do a collaboration. After sorting out some business terms, they agreed. Grima specified that there is to be no branding of Omega, no numerals on the dials, and that all of the jewelry aspects are to be produced by him, and for Omega to take care of the watchmaker. The result was groundbreaking pieces of wearable art with an emphasis on natural forms, semi-precious stones carved to be the crystal of the watches, and expertly crafted precious metal cases. Their collaboration was reignited further into the 70s, except for this time a bit more approachable from a budget and design perspective. I love how this collection encapsulates how insane the 1970s design was, and I think some of these models are still pretty undervalued on the aftermarket. Let me know what you think, and thanks for watching.